first of all i'm getting patience a lot of patience okay i'm getting this person right now is testing the waters with you there is no communication and they're choosing to keep quiet they've been very tight lipped about a conversation with you okay they're not opening up for right now this person does at the same time have a lot of faith that this is a divine connection it's a very distant connection it's a very spiritual connection here that they can't shake off so they have that realization for sure but at the same time they have a lot of faith a lot of trust that this is the right connection for them there's been an ending between you guys here but right now this person looks like they're going through a huge change a huge transformation there has been a lack of reciprocity from this person's side a lack of equal give and take either they were giving to other people they were entertaining others or this person probably had a lot on their plate and family career other responsibilities their goals friends was everything was more important than you after you went to things with this person and seeing that this person is still going through a transformation okay they're trying to alter a lot of belief systems and they're trying to change themselves why so that they can come towards you in the correct way and balance out this relationship i'm feeling here that here there was a situation where this person took more than they gave but again this person definitely clearly realizes now and they're awakening to this connection after this transition that you are the one for them okay but again they're still not feeling very comfortable reaching out to you okay because they want to give it some time they want to give it some time like i said they're testing the waters right now okay like what do i do what should i do but i feel they're going through a lot of changes okay this can be a change in their thoughts belief patterns uh the way they approach things their attitude whatever it is okay probably they're ending a lot of things that were disturbing or uh, influencing your connection in the past they're letting go a lot that did not work out for them in the past but i'm getting like a rebirth from this person here okay this person's going through a huge transition we have three major arcanas when it comes to this person's mind so yeah this person is going through a lot which is just not in their control okay um what's the tell me what's the harpen what's the harpen here so this person out here and getting someone here you know who probably you offered a lot of love to okay see the two of cups so you guys love each other a lot the connection still remains so they do feel a strong soulmate connection to you okay but the thing is that this person out here earlier you could have asked, asked this person to commit to you or you could have wanted to marry this person here this person could either have already been married because of which they couldn't take up your offer or this person was just not very keen on getting married or keen on wanting anything traditional now they're in two minds okay either they feel there's a missed opportunity okay and it's just not going to work out between you guys because things are over or this person is still um i think they're waiting for something to happen they're waiting for divine help to come in and automatically make things correct between you guys okay they're waiting for a sign from the from the universe or from the divine that you know what it's okay you can go approach aquarius you know they want to shut the door on your face well some of you may okay let's see uh what does this person feel what will this person feel wow what will this person feel for aquarius in the next 24 hours what will this person feel what are this person's feelings for aquarius in the next 24 hours Dude, I'm so fed up of these people's contradictory energies. They're so confused. All these people that you've ended things with. Hmm. This person has a lot of regret. Okay, they have a lot of regret that they didn't put in any work, any effort into this connection. This is someone here who probably thinks are very stuck and stagnant, okay, or thinks are just very slow moving with this person here. This is the reason why this person is taking their own time. This is just someone who's very slow moving, okay. They're just coming at snail pace. They're coming towards you in snail pace, okay. And I don't think you ain't got no time for this. You know, you don't have all the time in the world. They do love you. They have a lot of emotions for you, but you are not their focus right now. You're not their focus right now. as much as they would want to apologize to you they know they need to apologize to you they know they need to confront the situation they know they need to have some conversation and they know that they need they need to be the one to break the ice but they're consciously making a choice not to work on this connection because probably this person somewhere somehow has the faith that this connection is protected and right now they're probably working on themselves 
so that they can work on this connection. I'm getting here that apart from you, the only thing that keeps them busy or the only thing that is keeping you away from them is their work. They're very focused on something else. This could be a new project or they're just trying to distract themselves, okay? Rather than communicating with you and rather than being apologetic, I feel this person feels the need to put in all their effort in their daily routine, their daily chores or whatever it is, okay? But they're very busy trying to pursue or trying to get their day-to-day -day life correct, okay? They're trying to get their life together is what I'm getting. But right now, they're not they're focused emotionally. They're not focused on you at all. The love is there. But when it comes to literally going, coming towards you and uh, apologizing or even talking to you or breaking the ice, they're not doing it. Because their focus is something else. What's the Eight of Pentacles? What's the Eight of Pentacles? Yeah, this person's blocking you out for sure right now. Okay, they may be they may be wanting to pursue you, but the thing is that this person's a procrastinator. They're blocking you out. Okay, they're trying to be maintain peace right now is what I'm getting here because this person out here. Okay, it's like this person calls the shots, not in a way where they call the shots or whether they wanna. Uh, okay, not call the shots. Let me back that up. This person out here is the one who can trigger and start the relationship you know who can start the relationship again because you're not making any move towards them and you're pretty sure about that is what i'm picking up so this person knows that the relationship can start between you guys okay or at least they can break the ice but they're going to be the one who's going to have to break the ice here so they know it's them who needs to do this but right now they're feeling they're in a very difficult position right now where they'd rather choose you know they're trying to balance things out they're trying to maintain that peace within themselves rather than you know creating an environment which uh, has a lot of conflict involved. I think by working themselves on themselves right now or just trying to distract themselves or being a workaholic, they're trying to stay emotionally uninvolved. Okay, they don't want to involve themselves. They're trying to be emotionally detached. Okay, and I feel this person here, even if there's no goals here, I just feel this person here is not pursuing anything new. I think it's just that they're trying to distract themselves by not coming towards you and just trying to force themselves and dump themselves into work. If that makes sense to you. But they know they need to make a choice. There's a lot of regret that they have. They miss you like crazy. Okay. The kind of uh, pain that they're feeling. The kind of trauma that they're going through is unbelievable. But it's just. They're just keeping things deep within themselves. Okay. They are. They'd rather, uh, they'd rather stay shut. Or they'd rather be avoiding this problem. Avoiding this entire connection. Avoid making a decision. Rather than come towards you. Make a difficult choice and face the circumstances. That's just how they're placed. All right, tell me what action will this person, what action does this person plan on taking towards Aquarius in the next 24 hours? What action does this person plan on taking towards Aquarius in the next 24 hours? Saw the two of cups twice. What action does this person plan on taking towards the cross in the next 24 hours? Yeah, not surprised, right? Clearly not surprised. One more card. One more card, please. Beautiful. All right. As much as, as much as this person would want to come towards you, okay, seeing you as their happily ever after, they can't walk away from you emotionally, okay, but they're trying to run away from their emotions, okay. This person is someone here who likes to run away from their emotions, okay. They don't want to be emotionally vulnerable. At least for the next 24 hours. Okay. Remember, this is 24 hours, not forever. They are trying to keep themselves as happy as they can, Aquarius. They're fake it till you make it, is what I'm getting here. Okay. They're just trying their best to be out there, to probably even socialize, you know, or just to try to keep themselves happy. Keep They're just purposely ignoring you, Aquarius, in short. That's just cut short and sweet. They're purposely ignoring you. They're just trying to keep themselves very, very busy. The amount of attraction, love, emotions, whatever they have, they're trying their best to resist, okay, you. 
and they're just trying their best to like okay you know what that's fine if, if i broke up it's okay i can move on i can move on i can do this i can do this and the other contradictory is like no 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 i need to talk to aquarius now i need to talk to aquarius now i need to writing deleting messages writing deleting messages they really really want to talk to you okay like really 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 want to talk to you but this person won't they won't because they're just doing their best to try and tame the situation. It's like, how can I give in? How can I give up? You know, ego, pride is also what I'm getting here. Okay. Their pride won't let them contact you. Their pride won't let them contact you. Okay. Uh, I'm getting this person out here didn't really expect you to, you know, like let them go kind of thing. You know, is what I'm getting. I don't think they really expected you to let them go. Because they probably thought you were wrapped around their fingers all this while. But now that you let them go, it's like, dude. Did she really do that? Did he really do that? Like, he let me go? Kidding me? <laughs> it's like, yeah, dude. Sorry to break your bubble. All right, let's see. What's the eight of wands? What's the eight of wands? Like, they don't want to communicate with you. But they won't. They won't. Yeah. Yeah, they can sit there waiting, sitting, planning for an hour. Yeah, they need to make a choice about commitment out here, okay? This person definitely sees you as someone who they want long-term with, but the thing is that you walked away. Or this person's just running away from their emotions. That's the best way I can put it. They're running away from their emotions, okay? Right now, this person's taking a time out, but the problem here is instead of taking a time out here, okay, uh, I feel this person's reaching that point of being very restless and they're burning out. They're reaching that point of burnout, okay? Which is why they're trying to distract themselves out here. But yeah, I think while they're resting, the good part they're doing here is I feel that this person out here is doing a lot of brainstorming, okay? They're doing a lot of work on themselves, a lot of inner work. I think, um, yeah. So what I'm getting here is that this person probably out here is doing a lot of thinking about what their next uh, next step should be. Really, this is what they're doing. They're trying to think about what their next step should be, how they can come towards you. I feel that there's a lot of planning going on behind the scenes, which you don't see. But yeah, this person is dealing progress. They're dealing communication, dealing their own, creating their own stress, and they're creating their own delays here in this connection. This connection can can just like literally pick off like like any time. But it's them who's resisting this connection. Okay. I mean, they have a lot of realization what went wrong, what they did wrong, everything. But by testing the waters, by just, you know, like doing nothing about it, not taking any action, they're trying to buy time. Okay, they're trying to buy time. I feel this person is here trying to wait how long you can hold on communication, how long you can hold back communication. That could be one of the reasons why they're waiting. Because look, they're ready to talk to you. They're ready to wait, talk to you. But the thing is that I think with the temperance here and the eight of wands in their actions, it looks like this person's purposely holding back, you know. They're holding back on purpose. They're waiting for you to communicate with them, okay. Maybe if you don't communicate with them, they will come towards you. They'll finally give in, okay. They'll be tired of holding back from you. They'll finally give in because the love is there, guys. I saw the two of cups twice. The love is there, the connection's still there, and they have a lot of faith. But what happens sometimes that if you want someone to get take action towards you, you just gotta, you know, have that patience because temperance if you don't have the patience you gotta have the patience okay whenever that comes in that's just something i'm always trying to say take it easy take it slow release any kind of expectations release any kind of expectations or um you know that you have stop controlling the outcome okay it'll happen eventually but at least not in the next 24 hours okay that's what i have for you hope this reading resonates leave your comments below like share subscribe and i'll see you next time Bye. -bye.